Hi guys, welcome to another electronic clinic video tutorial. Today's video tutorial is about the uh, timers. What is a timer? It is an instruction that waits a set amount of time before doing something. And that is we can give a preset value. For there are there are like infinite situations in which the timers can be used. For example, one very common use of a timer is that you can use a timer uh, with uh, pressures, grinders, and variables in industries. Why? Because, for example, the operator turns on the switch. So, before the crusher or the grinder or any motor starts, it waits for five seconds, and first the buzzer turns on and it uh, uh, gives indication to other people around that motor that the motor is about to start so keep a safe distance so how to do that let's start the plc programming open the winful letter click on new select the type of plc you are using okay now let's suppose that the switch is connected to x0 in the plc and a buzzer is connected to y0 now let's make a branch, click V on the keyboard and press F for the function and write T. So we have total 0 to 255 timers, click OK. We are going to use the 50 timer and the preset value is 50. Now why the preset value is 50? Because if you can see over there, the seconds, that is 0 0.1. 0 0.1 multiplied by 50, that's equal to 5 seconds. So this is a preset value. This is the amount of a 5 seconds delay we are going to make a 5 seconds delay. And over here we are going to connect uh, Y1. So let's add some comments. This is a motor. And this is a buzzer. And this is the switch one. Now let's play this one and see what happens later we will add modification in this uh, first one so for example the operator want to turn on uh, this motor which is connected to y1 so, if he turns on. so you can see that the buzzer is on but when the motor turns on it won't stop the buzzer as you can see the motor is on and still the buzzer is on. So what we have to do, we have to make such type of uh, program, we have to make such type of program that first turns on the buzzer and when the motor starts, it turns off the buzzer. So how to do that? Click over here, click B on the keyboard for the normally close contact and write D50. We are writing T50 because we have to access this T up time when the timer is up. So not because it means that if the timer is not up, the timer will be up when the 5 seconds are completed. So let's turn this on. So it means that while the preset value is not reached to 5 seconds, Keep the buzzer on and when it is the, the, the time is up, then turn off the buzzer and turn on the motor. Let's play this one more time so that you can see. As you can see, the timer is off, so it's off and it's on. And it will be up, this instruction will, will become false and this will off and it will turn. So that's how it works. That's how this uh, this is a very small program and it can be used with uh, all types of pressure machines, conveyor belts, and the amount of delay can be changed from here. For example, this this time I want to make it for 10 seconds, so I'll write 100, 100 multiply by 0.1, that's equal to 10 seconds, and uh, now you see it will wait for 10 seconds. buzzer remains on for 10 seconds then it will turn off and install the motor. 
so you see So now in the next tutorial, we'll be using the set and the reset coils and the timer to make one project. That is uh, the first button press program, which is most commonly used in games and on TV shows. If you like my video, subscribe to my channel, share my videos and thanks for watching.